far. So the only thing I have close to me is the arm. So I have to work on the arms now. And I'm feeling he's so strong, I'm not feeling confident to go for submission from here. I need to switch positions. And I don't want to really give him a chance to open my guard and play with him. So what I'm going to do? I'm going to control both arms. I can control here at the end. Usually, you know, for the grip, I like to try to find the gi and grab. Because at the collar, I can, I can lock inside my hand. Huh? I lock the gi in my hand. Here, it's hard. So I need to find a better position. So I like this. See? Mm, too long. And I'm gonna choose for one of the arms. So I'm gonna grab this one here, his left arm. I lock his arm. I'm not gonna step on the ground here tight, just on the ground. But I squeeze my knees here when I step on the ground. See? Easy. My other hand gonna grab his pants here outside. If anybody from the side wanna see, just stand up and walk around. Okay, I grabbed the pants. Go behind, go behind people sitting down. Press play. That's good. So now, that was, that was pause. Pause, pause mode. So, lock, I grab the leg, grab the arm. So, when I grab this arm here, my intention is to block all the side here. So I block his arm, block his body with my knee here. Grab the leg, now I'm gonna straight my leg, look at this. It's easy like that, I straight my leg and move up all the way until, boom, and on my See it? So very important to understand, if you straight your leg properly and keep straight all the way, that's gonna happen naturally. I need the pants here, so I just release a little of the pants here. So I control here, step tight. Tight, leg straight, mount. You got it? Here. Come on. <laughs> Lock the guard. Good. Arms. One, two. Good. Grab the legs. Up, huh? Step on the ground. No, I don't feel the knee there. Squeeze the knee. No, no. Nice. That's what I want. Perfect. Leg straight. Solid, straight. Go, go, go. Nice job. 